Good morning, friends. Today is Tuesday, June 20th, the first full week that we're trading the September contract, the ESU contract, MESU if you trade micro E-minis. So let's start the week looking at the economic calendar. The calendar today has two events, neither of which is going to have any effect on the market. So let's move over to the morning news. Morning news, CNBC website, flags are generally in the red, not by a lot. We've had a very good week last week, and I'll get into the charts in a moment. Stock futures falls, investors kick off holiday shortened week of trading. What does it tell you? Absolutely nothing. And you're not going to find anything else that's going to tell you anything in the rest of the news. So let's move over to the charts. I use a couple of indicators to determine where the market is going to trade. We see the market is trading right now. It's about 15, 10 minutes before the open, 10, 15 minutes before the open. And the market is trading just about uh, 10 points below where it closed on Friday. So we will look to see if it's going to close the gap and then trade where it's going to actually go uh, today on Tuesday. The market, the beginning of the candle, remember every day is a candle, every day is a candle. And in the morning at the market open, we know the beginning of the candle, the key, the trick, the big question is, where will the market close? Where will the other end of the candle be? So that's the question today, as it is every day, traders. So thanks so much for watching. I've given you a little hint of where the market might go according to the calculations, the Taylor calculations, and uh, we'll see if the market complies with that. Trade safely. Have a great day. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Marv Eisen for Timeless Dollar Trading Academy.